If listen, if these tests come back and you're sober, you'll be all right. All right, what did I do wrong though? A mother's primary goal is safeguarding her child. Yet some mothers in our society jeopardize their children's lives with selfish actions. From the mother who neglected her child while under the influence. I'm, I'm conducting a criminal investigation into child neglect. Did you think it was okay after drinking three quarters at of a bottle point, of wine? At that point in time, no. I did not. So you didn't think so it was I'm okay, but you no. still did it. To the drunk mother who pulled a dramatic stunt at the station. Santa, I want this real woman to help me. Santa, let go. No, no, let go of me. Lena, Lena. Tell her to let go of me. Here are some instances when police arrest evil mothers. Please don't hurt my daughter. She's, She's been through enough. She's not gonna get hurt. The incident revolved around a 20 years old woman named Alexis. On March 26, 2023, in Fairview Park, Ohio, officers observed a vehicle go off the road into a ditch. Although the vehicle managed to continue driving, it allegedly sustained two flat tires. The officers promptly conducted a traffic stop to investigate the situation. The police stopped the suspect's car due to its improper condition and questioned her for accurate details. However, suspects often fail to provide complete information from their documents, prompting further investigation. When suspects are found driving with their child in a sober condition, endangering their lives, it's crucial to alert the police to take appropriate action and prevent a recurrence. <laughs> Hi. What's up? Uh, so the reason I'm pulling you over, you have a kid in the back in the back seat, and it's al it smells like alcohol in here. Have okay. you been drinking tonight? Yeah. Not that much. Five radio. Oh, she missed the drinking. Can I get another unit? No, I haven't drank that much though. I under I understand, uh, but you have a you have a kid in the back seat. She got out of her car seat. She got out of the car seat because yes. you you bumped into that road back there. It was really dark. I understand that. Am I going to jail? I, I need you to place your hands on the wheel for me, please. And go ahead and turn off the vehicle. All right, and then if you can hand me those keys for a second. There's no keys, push start. I'm sorry? I have a push start. Okay, well, where, where are your keys? 8055, I'm no sorry, idea. not here at this road. It's gonna be Valley Parkway and Wooster, the Wooster Hill there. I'm so sorry. You don't have your keys on you? Nope. Okay. Well, I do need to see your um, driver's license. Don't have one. You don't have a driver's license? Nope. Okay. Well, what's your name? Why? Because I'm, I'm asking you for your name. Have I done something wrong? I'm sorry? Have I done something wrong? Yes, you were. You went into that ditch over there, so I want to make sure that you're park. I understand that, but I want to make sure you're okay because... I'm good. Then you I, well, I, I have, drive. Ma'am, I have you stopped, so I need to see your driver's license. <laughs> I don't have one. You don't have a driver's license? Nope. Okay, well, I do need to see um, what your social. I'm going to prison. Ma'am, I need, I need to see your... I'm going to Mahoney. Ma'am. Be aware, there's a small child in the back seat. No! What are you doing? Ma'am. You're being rude. Ma'am, I'm not being I'm letting radio know that there's a kid in the back seat. I'll be in Mahoney County by tonight. <laughs> I mean, you guys are about to figure it out. One more time, that was She's being difficult. She was out of the car seat. No, she has one up. Y'all see it. I, I see that, but she's out of the car seat. She unbuckled. Why is this happening? Huh? I'm about to go to county. My nose is messed up. Hey, have you been yeah. drinking tonight? Yeah. No, not at all. I need you out of the car. All right, why? Just step out. Just step out, please. Just I can walk perfectly. Okay, I understand. Check the pattern. All right. Pat, do you have anything on you that can hurt me? No, stay here. What's, what's this in your pocket? Ma'am, ma'am, what's this in your pocket? What's that in your pocket? Keys. Keys? Okay. All right, cool. All right. 
Okay. If you can just come over here for me. No, my daughter's right there. I, we we're are. going right in the back of the... Where is somebody, please? Wait, what? They're, they're just... Why are there so many please? We have three, so I need you to step in the back of the... Back for me. No, my daughter. Ma'am. <laughs> she's okay. No, I don't like this. She's, she's with another officer, okay? She's okay. Okay. All right. There's the deal. Take a breath. Talk to me. What happened? <laughs> okay, you don't like police? I have... No, I don't. No? Okay, that's fine. <laughs> you don't like me. Uh, I'm mad. Want me to walk straight? Want me to walk straight? Okay, hold on, hold on. I can do that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We're just trying to talk right now. What happened? I come here late. She was here. What happened? I picked her up okay. from her aunt. I don't have a license. Don't have a I'm license. on parole. I'm on federal parole. I don't want to go to jail. I don't want to go to prison. I have my daughter. I just want to go home. Okay. I live in Tremont, okay? Where are you Please. coming from? To some dude's home. Okay. Stupid, right? Stupid. Like, I don't know what I hit. Where'd you come from before that? Don't know. No. Alright, she didn't drink at all today? I didn't drink, no. I don't like this. Alright, hold on. I don't like this. I want my daughter and I want to go home. I'll get an Uber. Listen, listen, listen. We're going to work on that. It's too many police. So we heard that there was an extra. That's why there's a lot of us. I didn't hit anybody. So the whole reason why we're all here is because we heard there was an accident, right? Okay, like, I need the, like... Take a breath. Take a breath. Calculation, what's going on? No, my, my kid's in there. She's, she's okay. She's okay. And also, uh, the circumstances that... What did you hit? Did you hit this one? No. I hit the rail, yeah. It was, I hit the rail. It was down there when I noticed it. I turned around, like, down by, uh, number one curve. I noticed it, I turned around, and that's when I had to pull her over. And how old's your daughter? Four. I'm just gonna get her checked out just as soon as she was in the picture. No, we're gonna have to do something. No, for what? She's not even here. She was in an accident. She wasn't in her car. There's a car she in there. Y'all seen it, right? She wasn't in We just want to double check. Don't you want to make sure she's okay? She's fine. It hit me. Well, we gotta make sure. Okay? I just want to go home. Can you figure that out, please? You got family around here? Who has a cigarette? How is there anybody here? We're not allowed to smoke. They test us. Oh, they push you from nicotine? Yeah. Yeah, lies. No, 100%. Hey, you got family around here? No, I don't. I'm from St. Clair. Okay, well, that's still around here. It ain't that far. Where am I at right now? You don't know where you're at? No. Okay, well, you're in Fairview Park. Where are you living at? I live in Tremont, my own house. You live in Tremont? Okay. I was going to say we should shut the Yeah, shut it off. Let's be extra. Let's be extra for no f reason. No, yeah. yeah. I just meant for the ambulance. Ambulance for what? We're having to trick your daughter. She's f***ing fine. Okay. Hello. Do you understand this right? Yes. Anything you say can be held against you in yes. the court. Do you understand this right? I know them. You have the right to ask to talk to a lawyer for yes. advice before you ask any questions. And do you have a lawyer? Yes, I have a lawyer. Do you understand this right? Yes. If you decide to answer questions now without a lawyer present, you will have to, the right to stop answering at any time. You also have the right to stop answering at any time you yes. talk to a lawyer. Do you understand this right? Yes. Do you understand all of the rights that are given to yes, you? Yes, I understand all of them. Okay. I've been arrested so many times. I know. All right. All right. Unfortunately. All right. Here's what we're going to do then. She's going to put you in the back of the car. I'm going to go with I don't her. I want to be handcuffed. You're not going to be handcuffed. I, if I she do got to check you. you. What I, is your check you. So I just got to search you real quick before I put you in the so back of my cool car. So we're cool with that, right? Okay. Hey, she gets to check you and then no handcuffs. Is that cool? Is my appeal going to find out about this? If, listen, if these tests come back and you're sober, you'll be all right. All right. What did I do wrong, though? We're, we're worried about the dog. So, Absolutely nothing. I've done nothing wrong. Alright, so she hit a dish and then she pulled, but that little kid, we don't know if she's in the car. She, she was. was in the booth. Alright. Sure I just need to see your hands for a second. There's uh, just uh, one hand at a time. You said there's nothing else in your pocket. Keys. You've got keys and lighter. Yeah. Keys and lighter. If you can I have my keys them. back? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're just going to hold them. We don't want nothing in your pockets on the way down. Hold Please don't hurt my daughter. She's yeah. been through enough. Okay, she's okay. All right, oh, Alexis, oh. we're gonna go hop up in this car, okay? We're gonna ride down to this parking lot. Let's go, let's do it. I can walk. Okay, hold on. Go to the other side, though. 
Okay. Yeah, other side I'm of the car. Sir. I'm not all right, cool. Listen, we're all good. We're all good. I want my daughter and I want to go home. <coughs> Hold on. Do the test first. Sorry, I didn't mean to open it. No, it's okay. I understand. It's all right. Here's this key in life. All right, cool. You got nothing in your shoes? Alright, cool. All you right. can put them back on on the way down, alright? I need my daughter and I want to go home. Alright, here's what we're going to do. They're going to get checked out by the ambulance. We're going to go do these tests, okay? No, I, I really want my daughter. No, I understand, yeah, but she can't come in the back of the car. No, I need her in the back of the car. We, we're not going to put her in the back of here. Where's my keys? I, I have your keys. Here's I have keys. possession of this. We're going to go do these tests, okay? Okay, let's do it. Alright, let's knock this out. Should we put the seatbelt on her? Yeah. Hey, we got to put that seatbelt on, okay? Yeah. Just because this is steep hill. Yeah, I'm going to... According to the law, officers must carry out procedures to confirm the veracity of their suspicions. Only a few techniques are deemed admissible as potential court evidence. One such procedure is on the verge of being implemented here. Four seconds. Four, 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 four. Cool? Yeah. All right. Okay. We're going to get through this. All right. <laughs> Figure it out. I got it. All right, so, yo, oh, you took your seatbelt off, okay. Uh, we're just gonna need you to stand in front of the car <coughs> so we get some light, okay? Right here? In front of the car. In, in my light, in my car. Like this? Yep, right here. I'm just stay right there for a minute, okay? Cool, I can do that. That's cool. Where's my daughter at? Right up on that hill. I need her. Well, look at that. You gotta figure this out real quick. All right, so do you wear any contacts? No. Nope. No, okay. Do you have any medical things that you can't perform the test today? Nope. Okay. So I'm going to need you to um, keep your eyes on the tip of this pin, okay? Do you understand? Don't move your head, Alexis. I'm sorry. Don't okay. move your eyes. I'm sorry. I should have said that. Do not can move I hold your head. the car? Uh, if you can you back... sit in the car. That's fine. Yeah, you can you sit. You can sit. And just move only with your eyes only. Do you understand? So how many did you have tonight? Nothing. I, I know you admitted to me up there you did. Fuck, okay, I had a couple. Oh, how many is a couple? Tight. Okay. All right, and then again, do not move your head. Just follow the tip of my finger, okay? can't see it. You can't see it? No. You can't see it back now? I can't see it now. Okay. Just only your eyes only. Okay. Okay, and then you just follow this going upwards. Alright. Alright, now um, I'm going to need you to go ahead. Hold Stay there. Do you need any clues? I'm ready. How about four? Okay. <clears throat> it's okay if I run you through that same test? Just yeah. double check? Yeah, sure, go ahead. Right. Alright, cool. You turn that off. Yeah. Alright, cool. Give him my pen. Can you see that? Yeah. Alright, follow your eyes and your eyes only, right? No, 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 don't guess. Follow the pen. Relax this. I'm serious, you You're no guessing. No. No, You're not, not following the plan. What do you mean, bro? You're guessing where I'm going. The plan's going. Right? Yeah. Left. Right? Okay, hold on, hold on. You're guessing. Bro, it's going this way or that way. I, I know, I know, and you are guessing. You know I'm moving the plan, and you're not moving your eyes along with it. Okay, I'm saying straight still. Go ahead. All right, cool. See the plan? Straight. Cool. Thank you. Now we're doing it. All the way. All the way. Ready? All 
all the way over here. Just your, just your eyes, not your head. You okay? Yeah. You take anything else today? No, I'm on parole. Okay. I'm trying to move my head. All right, cool. You good? Yes. All right. Hey, open your eyes for me. Alexis, up here. All right, cool. Thank you. That was good, right? We got to finish the other test. We got all two right. more tests, all right? Go ahead, do it. All right, so I'm going to need you to stick, put your left foot in front. Like this? Yep. Do this before. Well, don't, don't, don't start until I tell you. Just listen to me, right. okay? So do your left foot first. Left, right, left, right. Put your right foot in front of your left foot. Okay. Go ahead and do that. I have Fendi boots on, just so you know. I, I, didn't, say, I, didn't, tell, I didn't say to walk yet. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Just go, go ahead and put your left foot first. <coughs> Left foot. Then your right foot in front. Right foot. Put your arms on your side. And keep stay in that position until I tell you to do so. Do you understand? Yeah. Okay. You, you switch your feet. Left foot left foot on the ground. Right foot first. Right foot first. No, left foot first. Left foot first. Right foot next on top. Yes. Now stay in that position until I tell you to do so. Do you understand? Okay. When I tell you to do so, you're going to take nine steps down the line. And it's going to okay. look like this. One, two, three three and so on to nine. When you get to nine, you're going to turn in the following fashion. Okay, it's kind of cold. I, I understand. You're going to turn in the following fashion Don't and then... You? No, you're going to go down the line. Let me finish my instructions, okay? Then you're going to continue to walk nine down the step. Do you understand? Sure, got it. All right, go ahead and start. Nine steps? Nine steps. Yet. You're supposed to be counting. Oh, I don't know if you're counting or not. So I'm going pretty straight. Alright. Alright, we're going to do the next test, okay? Okay. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and stand straight with your arms like this. Okay, do not move from that position until I tell you to do so. Do you understand? Yes. Okay. So when I tell you to do so, you're going to lift one foot off the ground approximately like this. Do you understand? Left or right? It doesn't matter. You can choose. And then you're going to hold it for approximately, uh, as, uh, for the count of one 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000 until I tell you to stop. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, you may begin at any time. It's kind of difficult. Sorry. Okay, you can put your foot down. Alright, so I'm going to need you to put your hands behind your back. Why? Because you are being arrested for OBI. And you are being arrested now. I did all the tests right. I did all the tests right. Here's the thing. You did the test, okay? But from the results of the test that we have, okay, we believe that you're under the influence. So at this point, we're going to take you back into our, our holding facility here, and then we're going to give the option to do a breath test. Okay, bet. Okay? What's my daughter? She's going to be up there with our lieutenant, all right? Do you got any family that could come pick her up? No. Right now? No. Okay. Her dad, her mom, you got mom. No, her dad's a mess head. Okay, you got any, what's, what's up with her grandparents? No, I'm her only person. You're her only person. I'm on parole. And I don't need this. Swear to God, I can hold my leg. Wait, okay. Hold on, hold on. Here, here's, here, here's the thing. So we want to find somebody that can take you, okay? <clears throat> and I know you probably don't like us and, and, and you just don't want to cooperate right now. But here's the thing. If you end up getting arrested and we can't really What am I arrested you, for? OBI. What's your VI? Under the vehicle under the influence of alcohol. That's what you're doing. Are we going to Clinton County? We're going to get there. Okay? we got to figure out everything right now. Here's the deal. We want somebody safe, like a grandparent. I have nobody. Like you have nobody. Nope. No one. Nobody. There's not a single person in this world. Just me. She's the only one I have. So this is f***.
up. You guys don't care about anybody. You're racist. You're f***ing discriminating against me because I have face tattoos. And I can tell. You guys uh, don't care. I, mean, I think I'm, I'm going to have more tattoos than you. So it's not no, you tattoo, don't. Right? My whole body's tattooed. Oh, no, trust really? me. He's got I'm more. talking to the wrong one. My whole face is tattooed. You guys don't okay. care. It's fine. Okay, but like, uh, we'll walk like, in here, okay? This is the police station? Yes. Am I arrested? Yes. yes. For what? For OBI. <laughs> OBI what? I'm not even drunk. Well, we're going to let you take a breath test, okay? What city am I in? Here in Fairview Park. Of course. A suburb. <laughs> am I going to go to Mahoney <coughs> County? Hey, I'm going to go. Okay. Where is my kid going to go? When suspects try to exploit the officer's kindness by making excuses and behaving unexpectedly, the officers respond with appropriate legal procedures to address the situation. Sure, I can do it. I'm going to cooperate, okay? Do you have your phone? No! No, it's upstairs. Okay. Okay. You guys have my phone? It's in the car. <laughs> It's operating a vehicle under an uh, So I violated parole. Where is my daughter? She's with that lieutenant. Why? Because she, you, obviously right now you don't have anybody with her, so the lieutenant is with her right at the moment, okay? Let you go. I no. cannot let you go. Can you just open your mouth? I, I'm not allowed to smoke. Why? <laughs> because we get tested here. And smoking's actually really bad for you. I mean, I probably have black lungs. See, I, I, don't, I don't do that. <laughs> Why? Because then I don't want the black lungs. Why would you want to ruin your health? Do you have any drugs? No. Do you have any heroin? No. And then heroin? And then meth? I've done all of it. And like, I got sober, right? Mm hmm And I got sober from all of it. <laughs> I, I didn't know how to act, so I went to alcohol. I this is where alcohol got me. I know, we all No, you guys friends. don't understand. It's okay. No. I'm only 20. Yeah, I know. I know how old you are. You don't understand. I'm gonna go to prison tonight. Fall, fall, yeah. People fall on hard times. No, time. I'm gonna go to Mahoney County tonight. I'm f***ed, like... F***ed. I just got custody of my daughter back. And I'm gonna f*** again. And people wonder, like, oh, Lex, why do you drink and drive? Because I can't get my license. Keep get on even. And you guys are like my age. I'm probably about 10 years older than you. How old are you? 30. 30, yeah, you're 10 years old. I think I've been sober for a year. I got off of fentanyl. I was selling fentanyl. I got off of it. And then, like, <laughs> couldn't do fentanyl. I was doing fentanyl and meth, right? I was doing so much meth, so much fentanyl. And I got sober, and I'm like, Damn, I can't be sober, let's drink. I started drinking. And drinking wasn't the way to go. Like, drinking wasn't the way to go. I'd rather be on meth and fentanyl than drink. Like, 
I was really bad at it too. I was probably like smoking a gram of meth a day and snorting like three grams of fentanyl a day. Alexis was charged with DUI. Her case is now on hold because she is in federal prison with a scheduled release date of December 18th, 2023. While Alexis was caught by the police for careless driving and ignoring her own child, our next individual is taking it a step further when she puts the life of her child on the line. This incident revolves around a 32 years old woman named Lauren Frazy. On February 16th, 2022 in Alahua, Florida, officers responded to a call from a resident about hearing someone crying and seeking help. The officers promptly rushed to the location and began investigating further. Upon seeing Lauren, the officer recognized her from a previous incident. What further alarmed them was finding her car parked at a running boat ramp. The officers were astounded by Lauren's behavior towards her child. When they saw the child in an improper state, their suspicion grew. The officer then proceeded with the next step of the process. Oh my gosh, is she okay? I think she might be signal one. Right? You can cut the car off. You care if I open the door to help drain this water? Yeah. So what okay. what happened? I just went up to the boat ramp and I was thinking it was over full too. I work at Lonnie's Auto. I'm a single mom. I work my ass off. What's your first name? Then you can step out for me, ma'am, so we can chat if you want to grab your ID. Yeah. You cold, sweetie? Huh? You cold? Oh, I'm going to get you a jacket to put on. Like her medication water. bottle in her hand. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah. What's your you name? Wet a little bit? Lauren Frazy. Lauren? Yeah. yeah. Come on, step out for me, okay? Yeah. Where are my water shoes, though? Okay, just step over there where that truck is, okay? Where at? Over there where my truck is. What's your name again? Here, have a seat right here. Just sit just sit down for me. I want you to fall over, okay? What happened? So you just drove into the pond? Like, what you? What were you thinking? I was standing here, sitting in park, so I went a little closer and didn't realize how high it was. And then all of a sudden, last second, we're being put in. And I tried to pull it back out of the thing and I put the board in. Uh huh. And it just spun. Okay. And then I noticed that we're taking, or taking on water. What are you eating? You got stuff all over your mouth. What's that? What have I been eating? Yeah. I just ate a taco restaurant. What kind of drugs do you take? Me? Yeah. Chevy Tech. Is that what's in that pill bottle? Yes, sir. When's the last time you took Subutex? I take it every day. How much did you take today? Uh, I take one a day. You just took one today? Yeah. Just one? Why? What time did you take it at? Um, I go work at Lonnie's Auto here in Gainesville. I have to be there by 9. I take a half a dose around me. 8.30 and then I take another half a dose around 7.31 depending on how my seizures are going that day. Okay, because you're looking... Because I have my new brain, my, I got my new brain uh, look up next week. They get to take me a brain treatment or... Go. Out what's going on. You sure you just took one today? I swear to God, I mean, I have, I have a DWI. I have a bad Because you had one on your lip when I looked in the car to first talk to you. You had one sitting on your lip and it fell onto yeah. your shirt. You had a, one of your pills, a white pill. It ain't there no more. It fell down. Oh, and you're so you're nice. you're leaning all over the place. She can barely stand up. You guys, like you guys, I respect you guys. I would never want to do anything on purpose to okay. get in trouble. You doing okay, sweetie? Okay. Everything's okay. All right. We're gonna have the fire. The, you ever seen a fire truck before? A big red fire truck with the lights and everything. You've never seen one? Oh well, you're about to see a, a really cool truck. You're three months old? You sure you're not three years old? I think you're a little older than three months. I think you're a little older than three months. Yeah. And I'm scared. I bet. There's water in here over this. She's not getting out. She can't get out when she goes in the water. Yeah. I'm glad you guys got out. Are you okay though? Okay. My name's My name is Chad. Chad? 
Yep, Chad. Well, it's just, it's not normal to drive your car into a pond and you, you appear to be... I know. And I've been in a mental abusive a relationship and okay. I thought this is my way to get out. Well, while we're out here, just keep your hands out of your pockets, okay? Can I grab my vape? No. 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 Keep, just keep your hands out of your pockets for me. Okay. Just stand between the headlights. My whole life is work. Right here. Why is that? What other medications do you take? <laughs> what? I have something for anxiety. What's that? I have some type of anxiety in there that my doctor gave me last week to get rid of the bottle. It's for extra extractions I have, that I have for next week. And then I am the little white one. So all the medications that are in the car are prescribed to you? Yeah. So we're going to have EMS make sure that <laughs> mostly that she's fine. And then we're going to kind of go from there, okay? So once they get here... I hope I'm not in trouble. What did I do to get in trouble? Ma'am, you're on... No. Okay, all right. Well, we're not going to play a, a, a... You're going to play a victim here, okay? to your car there's numerous amounts of different unidentified medication in there that you're claiming that are all belonging to you which they very I'm well could be 91 year old that is not my car that is her vehicle there, there's a lot more here than than you just saying please don't do anything all right we we show up luckily the car wasn't still submerged in the vehicle okay i'm smart enough for that i would have gotten a okay. So why'd you park here in the first place? I parked about where that new sign is in the nav nowhere. My car just started flying. No, well earlier, when, earlier when, when you, you said when you can't. Well, it's not about earlier. You like, said earlier. Who said? Or whoever did it. Who cares? The point is, we go to the stop here because this is the only dog we get to walk besides the one in our home that my so she hates going to our dog. <laughs> so we go here every night. You can hang out right here if she wants to talk to you. <laughs> Somehow, some way, the vehicle ended up in the water and she backed it out. So, very young girl, no complaints on her either, but she has a. Okay. So you just live right up the road up that way there? Okay. You never go in body to water that go over your head. So. Okay. So they're going to look at you and me, okay? That's okay. Everything's okay. You can sit in my truck. My truck's dry. She can sit in the back of my truck. It's wet in the other truck. The only other question tonight is, have you had anything to, to, to drink or had any yeah, recreational no, drugs? Okay. Driving, driving while under the Driving while going in dosage of ACP. And I'm scared to take my drugs. Reverse the fact. Any questions? No. <laughs> Any luck? Alright, and you're not, you're not. You guys are cars that I can test with you guys? You guys work out here a lot? I know a lot of really sick people around this road that really need to talk with you. Alright, well they don't do that, that's not their job. Yeah, yeah we're just, we're making sure that, that well, you're good because if, if, if you're not good then you can't take care of her. Alright. Dude, shot him. Shotgun at me. Yeah, because I didn't take my trash can lid on. He goes, oh, well I guess I'll have to shoot the blank. Fire blank. We had the 220 in no Ocala. She living with where you live. You live with her. Not right now. At the house where I'm going. I'm going straight to Lake Susan. What's her What's her address? You know, I'm pretty sure my my phone is underwater. So what's her address? Just follow me if you want. I don't care. Can't leave you nowhere. Else. Good people, man. We're not following you. Yeah, this car's not going up here. Uh, you don't want me to drive? Nope. Uh, is your fourth year then? What about all the water luggage? 
Can you guys follow us? Nope. Can we drive it out to any nope. property? Nope. You want another sheet? You want another sheet? You want to get water out while well, I'm not going to be here. Hmm. We'll have to get something going yeah, for that. We can we'll get a tow or something. 5 a.m., 4 a.m., 5 a.m. We'll see. If you took this there, well, she might not even be able to see. We're not, we're not going through the car. Hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. We're not going through the car no more. Okay. Oh. You can stand over here, and that's did it. Did you guys see my car? My phone. I did not, but it's okay. So I'd like for you to, to stand friend? over there. No, you cannot. Please stand over here. How much is call my my ride? We are calling a ride for you. We need you to come over here so we can have some more chats. You're not gonna be able to get her on the phone. Okay. This one. Come over here, we'll explain what's going on, but I need you to come stand in front of his car, okay? Now I'm explaining to you what I'm doing to try Listen, Listen. Lauren, like I'm not asking, I'm telling you to go over to that car right there for me. This one right here. I want you to stand right there for me. And take your hands out of your pockets. Between the headlights, right there. Right where my light's shining. You okay? Okay. You still scared? You cold? Yeah. Are you okay right here? You sure you don't want to sit in my truck? It's warm and and dry. Are you sure? Okay. I didn't know she ran water. Mm-hmm. I'm really scared. Yeah. I'd be really scared. Alright, Lauren, I want you to look at me when I talk to you, okay? You're driving a car. Stay over there for me. Stay back over there. And you drove a car onto a boat ramp. You appear very intoxicated. You told me you took one Suboxone today. When I got here, there's a pill sitting on your lip and a pill bottle that's open by your I've got 90 a month. Hold on. Hold on. Take your hand out of your pocket for me. Okay. What I'm doing right now is I'm letting you know that I'm investigating you under the suspicion of driving under influence of narcotics. Okay. So what I'm going to request is that you participate in field sobriety exercises. Would you be willing to do that for me? Okay. Sit her in the back of your car and we'll just wrap up our cars over there. You want to sit in the back of my car? Why not? Can you do it for us pretty please? It's warm back there. And dry. My name's Patrick. Okay. But this car is really cold and it's wet everywhere. This car is really dry and it's nice and warm. You think you want to sit in there for a little while with us? No. Laura, can you scoot over here for me? I'm going to come back for you in a minute. Just keep your hands out of your pockets for me. How long were you, were you guys sitting here for? Um, we were in the water for, um, I think two. I think two. Huh? I never went over there. You never went over there? Okay. I want my vapor refill out of my car, but I respect you guys more. Hey, take your hands out of your pockets. Leave that. Leave the vape out. Just put the vape on top of the car for me. Here, give it here. Is there anything else in your pockets? <laughs> Don't reach in there. Don't reach in your pockets. Mm. All right. Hang. Nope. Stop it. Well, Ma'am. Ma'am, I'm going to check. I need you to turn around. I need you to turn around. I need you to turn around and face his car. Keep your hand out of your pocket. Are you a police officer? Yes, I am. Is he a police officer? Yes, he is. Mm hmm So you're both a police officer? Yes, we are. Um, and I am so happy that you are okay. I bet. Oh, we ran the water. Yeah, I'm glad you guys got out of the water. Yes, when we were going, we we're going that way. Yeah. We we're going that way, actually. That way. That way? Mm hmm. Okay. We were not going that way, but we we're going that way straight. 
Mm. And we were on that side. Mm. And now we just got out. After that, I saw the I, I saw that we're not in the water. So, um, we're in the water. Hell. <laughs> I was so scared. I was shaking. Yeah, I bet. To that side, and then she, and then she put her car and back up. Mhm. Mm she, she didn't put it in the back up actually. She put it in go, and then it went that way into the water. Really? Mhm. Mm I heard a really big splash. I can, I can saw the um the big splash on the water. Yeah. It's a big car. It's that big. Yeah, I see it. It's a big car. Yeah. Alright, don't sit down. No. Stand, come stand right here for me. Okay. Alright. Due to the rising suspicions, the officer decided to utilize a range of methods tailored to the specific circumstances. Following completion, the police made a firm decision and made a solemn promise. Oh, nope. We're going to start with we'll uh, a bunch of different exercises with you, okay? Okay. All right, about five exercises. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask you some questions first, okay? Yeah. However, I'm going to give you some instructions to how I want you to stand for the first exercise, okay? Mm -hmm. Step out where that to the, onto that line. Okay. No, put both feet on it. I want you okay. to stand like this on the line. Okay. See how my feet are? Mm -hmm. Take your hands out of your pockets. I know it's cold. You put them down here by your side like this. Okay? I want you to hold that position, okay? Oh. I want you to fall over. You can look at Maybe me. Maybe that velocity is impossible. Okay. See where your head's at? It's facing me. Okay. I'm going to move this left, right, up, and down, and in a circle multiple times. Okay. okay. When I move it left, right, up, and down, and in a circle, I want you to keep your head right where it's at and just fall with your eyes. You understand what I'm okay. saying? Do you have any questions about that? Uh, just follow the red light in front of you. Just follow the red light with your eyes and yes, keep your head still. Yes, so when I move it this way, I don't want your head to you turn. Want, I want you your head. That. You I want that. Want, I want your eyes to fall it only. Okay. Yeah, I know what you want. All right. All right. All right. For this one, I'm gonna go around your head in a circle twice. Okay. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring my pen in towards your nose. Okay. I'm gonna try my best not to touch your nose, okay? But when I bring it in, I need your eyes to stay focused on the, the pen the whole time. I'm going in a circle when I bring it in towards your nose. Good. You understand that? Yeah. All right. Try and try and stay where you're at, sweetheart. Yep. Yeah, no, I want you to stay staying right where I had you the first time, right on the line. Okay. Remember, just keep your head still and fall with your eyes only, all right? Should for your, for your brain. Okay. You can relax. You do? Yep, you can relax for a second. Don't sit down, though. Just relax. Stay normal if you want to. Take your left foot and put it on the end of the line like you have it now. Okay, your left foot's right where I want it to be, okay? Yeah. Okay. Then you're going to take your right foot and you're going to put it on the line in front of your left foot with your heel touching your toe. How fast do I get to go? I'm gonna, I'm, you don't need to go, you go as fast as you're comfortable. Well, don't start yet. Okay. It's gonna be hard, you know that, right? I want you to put your hand. All right, put your hands okay. down by your side for me. You so left foot front, right foot in front of it. Okay. So, you get left foot. Okay. And put your hands down by your yeah, side. Do I need to count. Put your hands down by your it's side. Down to the, 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 the okay. Go, and go ahead and count your first step from heel to toe okay, is one. So I'll count myself as twelve. So I can start like this. Yep. Right, start. One. Count your first step from heel to toe is one. Two. Can't keep my balance. Right. Can I start over? Nope, we're gonna just stop that one, okay? Why not? We're just gonna stop that I one, okay? Do Look, from the car I don't, the water. I don't want you to just fall over, okay? I'm not gonna fall over. Look, get right. We got a bunch, of, we got a bunch more to go, okay? No, nope, no, man, we're done with that one, okay? Yeah. All right. Oh, this is not a win-lose situation, okay? One thousand and three, and so on and so forth until I tell you to stop. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. Okay, so just count 100 to one. Okay, so I'll explain it again. Okay. Sorry, I work, I work three jobs. You're fine. I've got four kids. So feet together, hands down by your side. I want you to stay back on that line for me. Okay. And start. Okay, and then one Mississippi. Count, yeah, one start. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, ten. Okay, you can stop, sweetheart. All right. I used to be an Olympic I want you to walk back over there for me. Okay, we're not done quite yet. Okay, 
All right, this next exercise we're going to do is called the finger to nose. Okay. When I tell you to start, I'm going to give one of two commands, either left or right. Okay. Not, nope, you're not going to move. You're not going to move at all. You're not going to take any an steps. Give an example of left. Right, okay. So, when I tell you to start, I'm going to have you tilt your head back. I'm going to have you close your eyes. Right. Yes, like that. Okay. Then I'm going to say left or right. So for the sake of me giving you the example, I'm going to tilt my head back and I'm going to keep my eyes closed, okay? So I'm going to tilt my head back, I have my finger guns, and I say left. I'm going to bring my left hand up, touch the very tip of my index finger to the tip of my nose, okay? Then I'm going to bring it right back down after I touch it. Wow. Okay, you understand all the instructions? Well, I mean, you might have to, like, go over one or two. Again. Which exercise, which instructions don't you understand? Um, the instructions I don't understand is when you get up and tell me, you know, how to act when the run, one prop you're going to do. I'm supposed to put my, uh, my guns down. Yes, so you're standing like this with your finger guns <laughs> down by your side. Listening. Okay, then you're going to okay. tilt your head back and close your eyes. And listen. And then I'm going to say left or right. If I say, if I say, gonna tell you left or right. You're not going to tell me anything. If I say right, you're going to bring your right hand, finger, your fingertip of your right index finger to the tip of your nose, and you're going to bring it right back down. Okay, so. If I say left, it's going to be the exact opposite. So right? Your index finger, not your finger. You're, flick, you're just flicking me off right now. I need your index finger. Okay. There you go. Yep. And done. Bring it back down. Okay. And then if I say left, you're going to do it with your... Do it. You'll, you understand what I'm trying Ooh, to tell you? Sorry. Right. Yeah, I do. You sure? I'm probably never going to be able to wash. I'm okay. not going to be able to use the white car ever okay. again. Go ahead and make your finger guns for me. My... With both hands. Put them down by your side like that. I'm going to go ahead and start the exercise now, okay? Okay. Okay. Put your head back. Close your eyes. Left. Water make me really itchy. All right, you're gonna put your hand back down. Okay. All right, and we're gonna do one more exercise. Uh -huh. Okay. So, I want you to step right here for me. Okay. No, right here, where my flashlight is. Okay. Actually, you know what? You can, you can sit down for this one. You were like dead. Go ahead and just, just have a seat. Pop. Pop. Okay. I have nothing but time. Children. Do not. All right. So what I'm going to have you do is the counting exercise, okay? okay. Only when I tell you to start, you're going to tilt your head back and you close your eyes. Okay. When you tilt your head back and close your eyes, you're going to count to 30 in your head. Uh. When you get to 30, you're going to open your eyes and tell me you're done. You understand that? <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So reiterate to me what I said. You are going... Okay, it's hard to reiterate when I had three things going in my mind because you reminded me of my previous brother. Okay. He comes off duty up and coming. Okay. Whenever he... Okay, say the last two parts of your story. So, when I tell you to start... So do it here? Yep, tilt your head and back. You keep my eyes shut? Did I I'm, gonna, I'm gonna... Nope, just okay. keep your eyes shut, and I'm gonna tell you... Count go ahead. <laughs> count to 30, starting now. Are you not here? I come. You done? Mm -hmm. Okay. How long have you been with ASF? Seven years. I, I do. So I'm going to have you step up to my car so we can have a little bit of a chat, okay? Okay. Is everything okay? Yes, everything is fine. Okay, bye. Can you go to the light? Would you go walk with me to light over to my car? I'm here in a second, okay? okay. Go ahead and put your hands behind your back. Oh. Okay. Right now you're under arrest for DUI. Okay. Oh. I ain't joking. Okay. For DUI. Driving under the influence of narcotics. No, narcotics. Suboxone, whatever else you have in that car. This one? Well, on these two front tops. Yeah. We're in this one. walking in jail with on me. In the jacket? No, grab them here. Go on this. Go on the next front. Hold on. Go on the back. What do you think we'll get out? I don't know. I don't know what your... Do you have any criminal history? No, I don't. Hmm? What about my medication for the hospital? The jail will, you can tell the jail all the medications. Where's your cell, is your cell phone in the car? Yeah, probably. I will get your cell phone when we get over there and we'll call them. Pull your foot in. Probably in the water.
water. I've pull, got water. Pull your foot in for me. Are you the owner of a white Nissan Murano? Yes. I'm Deputy Perkins with the Lachie County Sheriff's Office, and I'm sorry to be calling you uh, with bad news. Uh, What's going on? Uh, she's currently being placed under arrest for driving under the influence of narcotics. She drove your vehicle into the Holden Park uh, boat ramp into the water. Oh my God. Uh, the vehicle was on and running when we got here, uh, but we need somebody to come down here and either take possession of the car or cart or what to call a tow truck for it. Is it drivable? Let me try, I turn it on. It'll turn on. I don't know how far it'll drive. Did it go all the way in the water? Uh, yeah, it was filled with water when we got here. It was dripping out of the, the uh, door sills. Is she hurt? No, nobody's hurt. I'm only going to tell you this one time. That's you're not, fine. hold on, you're not. It's important. You are not going to beat on my door like that. I didn't mean to. Talk to her when she gets here. Yeah. Who you talking to? Mm, Alright. Yes. Okay. Cool. Um, your purse and all that is going to go with her. Okay. Okay. Um, when we get to the jail, a female deputy is going to search you. Suspects often employ tricks to evade situations. At the very least, the officers treated the woman according to what she rightfully deserved. All this is done. Oh, is my caretaker, my nana, my nana is alone and won't be alone until I'm taken out of here. Okay, well that's not my problem, okay? Yeah. So, so are you willing to do time. the are you willing to do the breath test or not? Sure. Okay. <laughs> Recording. Put your hands behind your back. Ow! Put your hands behind Ow! your back. Stop. You guys want to be a piece of shit in my office. I get it. I get it. I have a, I have a hidden camera on me. I have a hidden camera. Yeah, she's scuffed. Uh, we'll get you up. We'll get you up. I have, I'm having a seizure. Let go. I'm having a seizure. Yes, you can. When you've had that blood, see, can I come here? Ma'am, can you get that room, ma'am? person under 18 in the vehicle, resisting arrest without violence, and neglecting a child with great bodily harm. She was also previously charged with battery at the traffic stop. She is currently being held on a $65,000 bond. While Lauren is engaged in reprehensible acts involving her child and facing consequences, our next individual is undergoing a similar process. In the two minutes that I'm speaking to you, it already seems like something's wrong. It seems like you're impaired to some degree. The incident is centered around a woman. On August 29th, 2022, in Pasco County, Florida, officers were dispatched to a local racetrack gas station where a good Samaritan stopped a woman from leaving the store with a case of beer. The officers promptly went to the location to investigate. When someone drives recklessly due to impaired senses, it can cause a major accident. It's crucial to inform the police in such instances. If a suspect drives their child in the state, it endangers both their lives. Negligence in these situations can endanger anyone's life. With outside help, the police may manage the situation and conduct a thorough investigation. Mm -hmm. So I'm in 
least how she could she have gotten it was not right. I'm not kidding. I'm not worried about being alive. I'm worried about child being alive. Oh, this is child being like all that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Um, oh. The issue oh, we have right. now is she's by herself. They put, they put um, her dad is oh. oh. somewhere in the huge realm. This is a child being left in all day. Yeah, absolutely. So, I mean, how long is this story? Well, I don't know. I think it's only five minutes. Yeah. No, so he's in the store with us, so he's online. No, I'm, I'm definitely going to call CPI. I don't feel comfortable with this kid with her. I'm not sitting in the corner. Yeah, friend, you don't want to know if I did. Yeah. Yeah. Um, give me a minute. I'm going to go for five minutes. We'll take some time. I'm going to go for five minutes. Yeah, let me go for five minutes. Thank you. CPI to come take the kid because she has no one to take this kid with. Awesome. All right. All right. Yeah, uh, yeah we're at the racetrack right now. All right. No problem. No problem. I appreciate it. So I just walked into a mess. Um, so I'm here at the racetrack with Flutier uh, and Sharukian and Marine Three. They got a call about this lady that was that was falling over all over the place inside of the racetrack. Uh, they get here, they do some investigating. Turns out that this lady drove here, openly admitted that she was intoxicated, drove here with the kid to get more alcohol, and I mean, she's visibly intoxicated right now. So, she has no one to drop the kid off. She's admitting that she said she drove intoxicated with this kid. I'm thinking 10-15 on, for child neglect. Now, let me ask you, um, how do I get a hold of CPI? Because I've never had to do a CPI call out. He's like, okay, all right. So I'm pulling a, I'm pulling a case number right now. I have, I have another uh, third shift unit coming out because someone's gonna have to stay with this kid if we go ten fifteen. So, so I'm, I'm already working on that. I'm gonna talk to this lady again. Um, I'm gonna, I mean, honestly, after what they gathered, I imagine I'm gonna double check that they were just spontaneous utterances in a non custodial interview. Um, with that being said, yeah, she came from right, right south of 54, that, that apartment complex on Fountainside. Yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to double check a couple of things with, with these guys. Now I'm going to talk to her, um, you know, post Miranda and see what she has to say. All right. All right. Thank you. Okay. Go in there and check it out. And they won't be here until tomorrow morning. That won't be an issue. I'll, so, I'll what, what did you guys either do? Were you here during the whole thing? Or? I actually was. So I was taking care of the guest. Um, it was another guest. I don't know if you saw her. She had a pair of them, but she was the one that came up to me and she was the one that was telling me that she called and her child looked back. So the girl in the picture earlier, that's the one we're talking about. Yes. Who was all of her? So the guest was saying that she was very truly intoxicated. And usually I've seen her all the time. She seems just fine. Yeah. Um, I didn't take care of her personally when the whole incident happened because our credit card went down, so I was like trying to take care of that. Who was actually dealing with her or involved with her? Uh, my associate she's inside. Um, but nothing seemed like really Was there any like point where she was like falling over or not standing up straight or anything that led you to believe that she was off today? The only thing that seemed a little off was when she was telling her that they were able to get anything and she was like trying to like hold her back a little bit. Yeah, so 
she didn't fall over or stumble yeah. or anything like that. Okay. That was stupid. I just seemed a little off. For me, because I always like see her all the time and I usually take care of her. I get it. That's why I was weird. I didn't know if you knew that. Thank you. Um, but yeah, no, I mean, that's, that's what still doesn't change much. This lady's admitting to drinking, not so really. So, I just want, so, I'm not interrupting you, but so the statue, I read it, because I was like, I know there's a part here that you don't have to prove it. So, it's by either knowledge or omission. So, I don't know what she admitted to, or what's going on for it. She's no, over But, just so long as someone's looking. We can prove that she was driving the car, right? I'm sure there's a camera right there points right now. Yeah. So, and all we have to articulate is that she's under the influence. So. Which she's already admitted, right? That's really intoxicated. She even said that she came back over here to get a glass of wine. After she admitted to drinking over at the house? Okay. All right. And so let me ask you, Deputy Trophy, with your experience, when you determined that she's probably under the influence of some form of intoxication. She said we're, she just said we're in clear water. Okay. Cool. Unfortunately, so, my camera. No, died. no, no, it's fine. It's fine. Okay. I mean, so again, uh, at this point, I think we have more than enough, especially with her being that stuff non custodially. So it's, it's disorderly. So it's disorderly talk for what she did in the store. Uh-huh. Child neglect for coming here to the car. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. Just give me a minute. I just need to speak to her. Um, okay, I just want to make sure Yeah, she's okay. Um, have you spoken to her at all today? Today, she just came by the office. Okay. She was waiting for her son from school. Okay. Oh, all right. Did she see fine? Yeah, she's in fact, but we're transferring her to a different unit, so she just wanted to know her move out. All right. So, um, I'll explain more in a little bit. Um, what, what's her first name? I think it's Taylor. 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 They'll give us a little bit of time. We can't have you speak to her. I need to speak to her. Okay. Oh, I'm, I'm actually parked at the farm. And who's the shepherd? That's her father. That's her son. father. Oh, okay. all right. Does and he live locally? Uh, I'm not sure. I'll be my father. Okay. 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 You're not listening to me. I'm Deputy Garcia, okay? You're Miss yes. Answer my question. Are you Miss Yes. Okay. All right. So I'm going to explain to you what's going on. At this point, we're conducting a lawful investigation into child neglect, okay? So before you before you start, I'm going to advise you of your Miranda rights, okay? Because at this point, you're detained. You have the right to remain silent. And if you say can and will be used against you in the court of law, you have the right to talk to a lawyer and have a present with you while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before any questioning if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any questions or make any statements. Do you understand each of these rights as I've, as I've explained them to you? Yes. Okay. So you understand everything that I've explained to you? What? Do you understand each of these statements that I've said to you? Yes or no? Yes. Okay. But why? Why what? He explained to you that you're detained. He has to read your Why am I being detained? Okay. So I just explained it. I'm, I'm conducting a criminal investigation into child neglect. The child no, it's not. It's not like that. Okay, so what's been going on today, ma'am? Because I'm going to okay, be honest so speaking to you. Was, in the two minutes, moving. just wait one second. In the two minutes that I'm speaking to you, it already seems like something's wrong. It seems like you're impaired to some degree. So what's going on? Impaired? Here? Give me a drug test. Okay. Because I, I'm not into. I'm not. Next to that white one. I'm not into. I'm not, I don't do drugs. Are you serious? So you explain to both my deputies that you've been drinking wine at your house. I have been drinking, yeah, I, okay. I have been drinking wine because I'm moving. Okay, so you've been I'm drinking wine. I'm moving to a different com- complex. Okay, all right, okay. so you've been drinking wine. How much wine have you been drinking today? Um, I don't know. Probably you don't know? Like, um, a bottle, maybe? A bottle. So, would you say that you finished that bottle prior to you driving here? Not really, no. What's not really? How much of the bottle did you finish? I don't, 
No, like three quarters of the bottle. So you finished three quarters of a bottle of wine by yourself, and you thought it was okay to load your kid into a car and drive him across State Road 54 at 5:30 at like the end in, in the middle of the day when there's when there is traffic like there's no one's business. You thought that was okay. When suspects fail to admit their mistakes, they create unforeseen situations with the police. In such circumstances, the police must adhere to the necessary legal steps for dealing with suspects. Like uh, answer my question. You thought that was okay? I was just trying to go back to my apartment to pack up my stuff That's because not my I'm question. moving. That's not my question. Did you think it was okay after drinking three quarters of a bottle point, of wine? At that point in time, no, I did not. So you didn't think so it was I'm okay, but you no. still did it? What do you want me to say? I'm asking you, I'm trying to understand why you thought that this was okay because to do. Because I know you're being recorded. Yeah, I know. I, I know yeah. I'm being recorded. Okay, so, no. no so you I, didn't I, think I, it was okay, but you still did it? No. No. I did not do it. You didn't do it. No. So you ended up here magically. You flew here. Your kid I ended flew. up here magically. Yeah. Okay. All right, do me a favor. Put your hands on your back. <laughs> I'm not playing this thing with you. Hold that. So, uh, I don't. How much of my partner explained to you what's going on? Do you understand what's going on at this point? I kind of figured it out because I already got a while ago two DWIs. Okay. He hasn't really told me anything right. what happened. Okay, but I explain to you what's going on. Yep. So, she's going to be arrested for child neglect because she drove the kid here while she was drunk, okay. as well as disorderly intoxication. Okay. Yeah. So, with that being said. Yeah. With that being said, yeah, would you be would, would you be willing to watch over the kid for the oh, time yeah. being? Okay. Yeah. So what my partner's doing right now, it's essentially background check just to make sure that we'd be allowed to release him. Which you you told me you told me a couple of DWIs. If that's it, I don't foresee it being any other. Twenty ten and twenty fifteen. Yeah, I don't I don't and see I'm that being totally an issue. Totally sober for yeah. the whole time. Okay. Did uh they come back and say that he's good? Waiting on the phone call. Okay, all right. Good. Apparently, you did it Yeah, you are. I mean, how did you end up here? Did she just tell you that you, she well, was she here? she told the neighbor that she needed a ride. Okay. So I figured I was off from work. I was like, okay, so the gas station's right there. Okay. Um, yeah, so I mean, I she, didn't, I didn't yeah. know anything. So just, just to put your mind at ease, a little kind of at ease, she's being placed under arrest for a couple of charges. The kid's going with the grandpa. That's where we're going for now, okay? Okay. All right, if you have any questions, you can call and request to speak to me. I'm Deputy Garcia, all right? All right, thank you. The woman was taken to the local jail and sentenced to two months of probation, in addition to being ordered to pay a $4,200 fine. While the woman made the situation worse for her, our next individual went beyond even the wildest of imaginations. Right now, I don't believe that you have the capability of driving in a motor vehicle on a roadway. Oh my God. Would you like to perform some exercises? The incident revolved around a woman named Kristen Willie. 
On March 20th, 2022, in Indian River County, Florida, officers responded to a call reporting three kids engaging in reckless behavior on the road. Meanwhile, another woman arrived, arousing suspicion among the officers. They promptly approached to investigate the incident. The officers came into contact with the suspect. They were surprised by her reckless driving. Consequently, the suspect tried to mislead the officers, but the officers patiently tried to communicate with the suspect. Let's see how her reaction was. What's wrong with you? Say it again. J -A -S 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 you think I'm playing with you? Why would you throw stuff in the road and people driving their cars up and down the road? What if somebody drives over that stuff and hits a tree and kills themselves? Because they tried to avoid hitting that stuff. That, that's, that's, that's good, right? That's nice, right? And you mess up your whole life. How old are you? Is? 14. You're 14. You don't know how to spell his last name. 14 years old, eighth grade. But you know how to throw stuff in the road and mess people's cars up. Hey, y'all keep on y'all keep on doing bad stuff like this and you're gonna end up going to jail. And you, you're a small dude, man. Jail ain't going to be a good place for you. I'll tell you that right now. The kids are going to take all your food. You're going to be smaller than what you are. Go ahead. Start cleaning it. Help them, help them clean it up. No, clean the road up. I don't care about that. Clean everything y'all do in the road. I want the road to look just like it was looking before it came. You don't know your last name, and you don't know a number. So where, where am I supposed to take you at? Jail? I can't leave you out here. I don't want to hear that. So you don't know how to spell your last name. You don't know your mom's real name, and you don't got a phone number. So you know where I'm gonna take y'all at? If y'all can't get your stuff together, I'm gonna take y'all to jail. All three of y'all gonna go in the backseat of my car. Y'all not in his car. His car's way up there. And y'all not walking up there anymore. Is that where y'all wanna go at? Let me see. Oh, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not here to scare you or none of that. I'm legitly asking, is that where y'all wanna go? So y'all better get your information together, and if you don't, I'm taking y'all somewhere. I'm gonna take y'all where y'all wanna go at. Y'all, y'all wanna go to jail. Because if y'all didn't wanna go to jail, you'd be at your house, in the house, or hanging out at each other's house or whatever you'd be doing. You wouldn't be out here throwing all these br um, bushes and all this stuff in the road and rocks and having a bottle of alcohol. I don't want to hear we found it. Do y'all been drinking? No. Why your eyes all watery? Oh yeah, your eyes red too, man. I've been sweating. What? This is sweat. I am. What am I talking about sweat? Your eyes watery and your eyes look watery. See, I've been drinking. Oh. What grade are you in? I don't do a breath test. Eight? What are you in? Uh, eight. I don't do a breath test. How old are you? When you go to jail, they'll do that for you. Fifteen? When y'all go up to the jail tonight, y'all can go in there with the killers. There's, there's kids just like y'all that, that kill people, and y'all can go live with them. And they bigger than y'all, too. Cow, watch out. Whoa! What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? You almost ran into our car. We got kids up here. What are you doing? Put the car in park. Put your car in park. Put your car in park. Put it in park. Put it in park. Put the car in park. What, what are you not understanding simple I, instructions? I know, I know. Oh my There's, God. You almost ran into us. I didn't. Yes, you did. Unlock the car. Oh my God, I'm sorry. It's, oh my God. And, 2204, we're gonna have no. traffic at the oh same god. location. Oh my god, oh my god. That uh, the suit is out with the juveniles. No, I. Hey, I don't wanna hear it. Don't wanna hear it. What do you mean? I don't. Get your driver license, you prove insurance, and your registration. Driver license, prove insurance, and registration. Get those. Get, no, I don't wanna hear it. Get those items I'm requesting. What? Put the window down, ma'am. Put the window down. I am. I am. Okay, and I'm, get the stuff I'm requesting. I am. I am. Why is the window not down? Put your window down. Don't do it, honey. Uh, it's, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. He's I'm, not even in a seatbelt in the in the car, I, and you're driving like that. Oh my God, he's. Who's what? Shut shut your car off. Turn your car off. I'm not gonna ask you again. If I have to tell you again, you're gonna get out of the car. Where are you coming from? Uh, we were, we were, uh, stop we looking were at him, house. look at me. Oh my God, I'm at my friend's house. He's like, 
You okay in the back seat, son? I'm not mad at you, okay? Oh Where there's a little. Do you, 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 do you see how close you are to this yes, police car? I do. Do you know how fast you were going? I had to pull those three kids off the hood of that car because you were so close to rear-ending the car. It's it's nighttime, it's dark, and there's a bunch of blue, red, and white flashing lights, and you got this close to a police car going the speed you were going? Where, have you been drinking? I didn't. I'm telling you. You were at my okay. house. Okay. It doesn't matter. Can I... Give, give that deputy the information. Hey, y'all need to stay at that car, okay? Stay in where you're at, okay? Just don't stay by the car. Ma'am, I'm going to ask you one more time. Driver license, proof of insurance, and a registration. You still haven't given me those items yet. Ma'am, you know you were speeding. I thought no, I... No, I, I didn't. I'm like... Ma'am, so you're saying that I am... No, I, I, I I'm didn't not, see you I'm, speeding. That's what you're telling me. You almost ran oh, into the car. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Not Have you had anything to drink tonight? I got. We think three kids on the side of a dark lit road, throwing stuff in the middle of the road. This lady would have plowed right through the three of you, and we would have had called the parents and tell them that we got three dead kids on the side of the road. You understand? Okay. I know you get. You're young. You're having a good time. You guys think you know whatever. Whose parent is this? Yeah. Ma'am, no. have you had? He just lied to a police officer. Right? Yes. She did. Yes. You feel unsafe in the car? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna get you out of the car. Okay, let you come out, and hang out with us. Hey, hey, Masu, hey, Masu, come come over here and get the kid out of the back seat. He said he don't really feel that safe in the car. Yes, he does. He just said he don't feel safe. He says he's in the middle, so he wants to get out of the car, and he said. Do not feel safe. Hey, stop looking at him and stop talking to him. Talk to that deputy. Hey, come here, man. You can't lie to a police officer. Just come here, I'm man. I'm not lying to a police officer. You have had something to do. I did, but I'm not lying. No, you just, you, you lied to me. Oh my God. You lied to me. So, man, what I'm going to have you do is I'm going to have you step out of the vehicle. Uh, my mom was at her friend's house. Okay. And um, we were coming home, and then I saw the cop car. And then I saw, I told her to stop, and then it was, and I was like, okay. Come here, come here with me, okay, bud? Listen, I'm gonna have you stand, I'm gonna have you stand behind this patrol car right here, okay? You just relax, okay? Let me you no longer at my house. You no, 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 I promise you, I barely saw it, and Masu was like, hey, this car is about to hit us. And uh, we should stop the car. Right she's uh, not she's, she's not retaining anything we're telling her. She's not be, she's not getting the information we needed. It took her a long time to get it. Uh, she, appear, she appears to be impaired. Okay. And she's she's all over the place. She starts screaming and stuff, and so God, that's why we got another place. person. I just so, want to go home. Ma'am, I'm going to continue what I was asking you. Okay. I just want to go home. Ma'am, ma'am, can you focus for a second? Just for a second. I, I okay. have no you, focus problem. Okay, okay. Go. You had Go. two drinks of vodka, correct? Go. I'm, at, I'm talking to you now. You had two drinks of vodka, mixed drink, correct? Yeah. Two hours ago is what you were saying? I don't know. You. That's it was a party. Okay, you don't know. It was you. a party over in the... I'm, I'm listening to you. So as you had drinks, you got it behind your wheel of your car and you drove, right? Oh my God. Please. Ma'am, I'm actually Let me a go home. I'm a teacher. I work at the high school. Let me go home. I'm not letting you I drive I didn't do a bad thing. I'm telling you. I... All right, ma'am. Right now, I don't believe that you have the capability of driving in a motor vehicle on the roadway. Oh, my God. Would you like to perform some exercises? No, I wouldn't. Okay, so... I got nothing to prove for you. All right, so I'm going to let you know right now. If you deny doing these exercises, you could be placed under arrest and they can go get you criminal. I know. So I'm letting you know, if you refuse to do the exercises, you can be placed. All right, man, when you're done talking, I'll talk.
please let me go. Ma'am, when you're please. done, when you're done talking, I'll talk for you. Let me go. Oh, God. We're past that. Yeah, we're really past that. Oh my God. <laughs> Ma'am, I'm gonna ask you oh one more God. time. I'm gonna encourage that you do the exercises to either disprove or prove that you are intoxicated or not. I am not intoxicated. Okay, so I'm gonna I give you. I swear to God, I just want to go home with my child. Okay, do you want to do the exercises or not? What? What do you want me to do? You're gonna perform some exercises. Oh my God. If you don't want to do it, that's fine. I'm not gonna force you to do it. <laughs> I just want to take my child home with me. I need to know me. what you want to do, ma'am. God, I'm not... At a certain point, the officers decided to conclude their conversation. Subsequently, they took action against the woman in accordance with the legal procedures. No! You don't have to do this! Hey, get your cuffs out. I got it. Get your cuffs out. Get your cuffs out. Oh don't, listen, don't worry. Okay. They're just putting her in handcuffs right now, okay? Because she's obviously been drinking. Yeah. They're trying to calm her down, but she's rowdy, so you don't have to worry about it. Right now, they're just trying to calm her down, but she's, you know, she, when you drink, it kind of gives you it. <laughs> now you just call her resistant oh charge. Good job. <laughs> if you turn around, you're going to be playing on the hood again. You hear me? Oh my God. <laughs> do not do anything other than what you're told to do. You understand? <laughs> Need like? All right, please, do me a guys, favor. My baby, I understand. No, you don't understand. Please. Ma'am. No. You got to come over to my car. I don't want to have to drag you. I'm actually nice. Can you walk over here? I don't want to do that. Please, let me go. And your son's right there. I don't want to do that in front no. of your son either. Can you walk over here? Yes, of okay, course I can. Okay, let's walk. Let's walk. Oh, my God. Please. Here. Come down here. Have a seat in the back seat of my car. Oh, my God. Have a seat in the seat of my car. Oh, my God. Have a seat, ma'am. I, ma'am, I, please do this. Oh I don't want to force you in the backseat of the car. Just, can you have a seat? Watch it. Watch your head. Oh my God. <laughs> your mom's in the backseat of my car, right? Yeah. Do you have somebody, uh, your I, father? Larry calls uh, his my, up, right? my... Okay, so what happened tonight? So we were coming back from a friend's house and coming down, and then I said, I saw a car. And I told her to slow down, and it was like the, at the last second she started to go on the brakes, and I, I thought she would see it. All right. Open the door. All right. So as long as you're good, I just want to make sure you're good, okay? I'm concerned about you, okay? Stay, stay right here, okay? I don't want you to get. Open the door. No, stop. I, I just went into the front of my car, and I can smell it. Like Please. Really I'm hot right now too. Oh God, please talk to me. Why are you screaming? I'm, what, I'm worried about. I won't talk to you please, until you calm down. Please talk to me. I will That's not talk. Me. Act like an adult for two seconds. An adult for two seconds. So far, I'm charged with uh, resisting. I'm sorry about what happened tonight, buddy. I, I really am. Kristen Willie was charged with DUI, child abuse, and resisting arrest. For more videos about criminals, hit the subscribe button.